apparently some of you have some comprehension problems. So let's see if we can be very, very specific and clear about this this time. You are right, 100% correct. You have 100% control of your body. It is 100% your choice to not to want to have sex. Your choice. Nobody should be able to have control over your body but you. Now that that's out of the way, let's be very clear about this next part. Because this is the part that you seem to can't comprehend. That is where your rights stop at your fucking body. Although you have 100% control over your body, you do not have a right and you do not have any control over your partner's body. Despite that he's a man. You just don't like hearing that because you want to maintain 100% control of your body and his. You want to dictate when he gets to have sex and when he doesn't because that gives you power. That gives you control and you like it. You do not like it when that's fucking taken away from you because see, we all have choices. You chose not to have sex when you knew he wanted to have sex because you viewed what you wanted more important than what he wanted. Now he gets a choice because it's his body, his fucking choice. And if he, like you, views what he wants as more important than what you want, he'll go out and get sex with someone else. Now you've both made the exact same decision, which was, I'm focused on me and what I want more than what you want. And I'm going to do what I want over what you want. It's fair game, fair play. You just don't like it. You're going to call him an asshole. You're going to say he's trying to coerce you into sex because he's threatening to go fuck someone else if he doesn't have sex, if you don't have sex with him. Um, but it's not coercion. It's just him making the same choice you did. He has bodily autonomy just like you do. Because at the end of the day, if he's not there for you emotionally, he's not supporting you, he's not communicating with you, you will go find that from another man. And you won't call that coercion. You'll just tell him, you pushed me to this. You didn't communicate with me. You pushed me into another man's arms. You didn't support me. You pushed me into divorcing you. If him going and having sex with someone else is coercion, then those things are coercion. The reality is none of them are. They're just expectations and they're boundaries. So when you choose and you get to choose what you do with your body, so does a man. You just don't fucking like it. <laughs>